It's Monday, April 14th, 2014. I'm Janice Yamalka, and this is DX Daily. Illmatic Week begins today at Hip Hop DX, and DX talked to AZ on his contributions to Nas's classic debut album. With what started as AZ attending a studio session to show his support for the Queensbridge rapper, ended up turning into AZ recording Life's a Bitch, and eventually ending up as the only guest feature on Illmatic. The exclusive interview also goes into detail about his thoughts on being independent and his collaborations with Beanie Siegel, Little Brother, and RZA. AZ also adds his two cents on the historic beef between Jay-Z and Nas and chooses between Ether and TakeOver. So we all know a Nas discussion isn't complete without choosing who had the better diss track. So what do you guys think? Let us know in the comments section below. In more Nas news, Outkast may have reunited at Coachella, but it was Nas who stole the show during the festival's first weekend. Nas performed classic Illmatic cuts, of course, giving the fans what they want, especially with the album's 20th anniversary coming Saturday. Then, Jay-Z surprised the crowd as he joined Nas on stage and performed Dead Presidents and Where I'm From, in which Nasty Nas threw in ad-libs. After a roll of solo tracks, Puff Daddy joined Nas on stage and made sure to leave him with words of praise. If it wasn't for you, hip-hop wouldn't have arrived to this place right here, Diddy told Nas. Make sure you check out the full Coachella set on DX, as well as other sets from Pharrell, Outkast, and more. Friends let friends meet Drake? For this special teen, her friends made sure she had a chance to meet the Toronto rapper. Drake surprised Kennedy Brown, a teenage cancer patient in Houston, over the weekend, which was driven by the social media campaign hashtag DrakeForKen. In addition to rallying a visit from Drake, Kennedy's classmates also reportedly surprised her with an unexpected prom celebration in her honor. On Friday, Drake met with Kennedy and shared their moments together on Instagram. He wrote on one of the posts, she asked to touch the brows, hashtag access granted. Sounds like a great way to kick off the weekend. Those are today's top headlines. For more music and news and to follow our coverage on Elmatic, log on to hiphopdx.com.